Hello and welcome back. So today is episode two of my beginner journey to 1500. I need to change the rating range. Let's do 50 and plus 100. We're doing 10-5, so hopefully we'll be able to find somebody. I'm currently 1185. I may have tilted and lost a few games, but it's okay. If I can't find a 10-5, then I'll go ahead and do a 10 0 Alright, we got one. Go C6. Oh, we get the fantasy. Oh, what is it? What is it? I think it's E5. And if he takes... If he takes, then... It's here and here. I believe. Okay, he does take. I'll go... Oh, I think... Yeah. I think you can do bishop or queen. Either one. There's a cool trap here and I'm trying to remember it. I believe that's actually part of it. <laughs> um, yes. Yes, that is part of it. Because they don't want to go here, because you take, take, and then they just have doubled H pawns, which is ugly. So now I can go here, and then I believe check here, then queen to E3 would be mate. But how do you stop it? How do you stop it right now, if you're white? Is it already too late? Hmm. Yeah, so if you ever go against the fantasy variation, you're a Carl Kahn player and you play um, against the fantasy variation, E5, remember that. Okay. I think I win check and then mate yeah well okay <laughs> that's a good way to start it out all right yep so whenever you see the fantasy variation against your Karl Khan go e5 and then if they take here then you can uh, build a battery here okay they say queen first is better but I think Developing your bishop is a little less suspicious, maybe. Um, they either have to move the queen, or they have to move the knight again, after they just moved it. Well, that was an easy checkmate. Okay, on to the next one. <laughs> We're now 1193. Hopefully it won't take too long to find a, another rapid. Hey, we got one. And we're white this time. Let's try E4. See if we can get a Vienna. We get E5. Okay. See if we possibly get the Vienna Gambit. Accepted. No, we don't. But this is a very fun line. Whenever you see the two horses come out, take. And then we're going to push D4. They go back. Or here. Either way. Either way, we push E5. This is uh, similar to the Halloween gamut. Okay. Guess I'll just take care. I believe I can still go Queen E2 here. And there's actually a, a very cool trap. I don't know if it'll work. Um, okay, so he pushes here. Um, I think I can go knight here. And then if he goes back, I check. He takes it. 
I take here with discover check. Yes. I think that's it. And wait. But if I go here, he'll, he'll just take with this knight. So I guess I just take this knight. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the better option. I just take the knight. And how do I want to recapture? I guess I'll recapture with the bishop. So I'm targeting this knight. Could also go here. This is also free. Could go here threatening this. Hmm. I actually like that. I think this is my, my best option. Okay, he defends this now. Very nice. Mm. Now I can take. Ooh, here's an idea. If take, then here. I can take. Recapture. Check and win the rook. I think that works. Take rook to g8, and then I capture here. I need to capture here so that this isn't attacked. Take, he recaptures back. Then I have a triple fork. So I could take here and lose my knight and my pawn, or I could take here and lose my pawn. Hmm. I don't know which way is better. I think I gain more material if I take here. I'm not positive though. We'll go ahead and do that. And then he takes. I'll defend. Okay. Makes sense. Go here. Attack the pawn. And defend this. I'm threatening knight to f5, which would be a fork. Okay. I get the fork. I believe. Okay. Opponent had enough of that. Good game. 97.9. Oh no. <laughs> that was just a line I was very comfortable with. And then I saw this idea, which is really cool. Proud of myself for spotting that one. Okay, so this was actually the right move. Like, I don't think this is bad. I'm just not as far up in material. Okay, let's try one more. Those were two very short games. Knight to c6 is not a good way to refute the Vienna Gambit. Playing against Sano Witcher. Uh, let's change it up. I'll go e5 this time. Let's see what we get. Going against a Rui. He takes. He castles. We'll go here. You know, since the last two games have been kind of trappy, let's try and uh, do one here as well. If he goes back, I'm going to go knight to g4. h3, h5. Hmm. 
If he plays h3, I'm going to instantly play h5. Okay. He does not. Hmm. I could just take. Takes, takes. Here. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll go here. Okay, so let's go ahead and go h5, and let's hope he takes. I'll go ahead and pre-move it. <laughs> if he takes, then it's pretty much game over. This is called the fishing pole trap. They have to be castled, and you shouldn't be cast castled. Okay, he does not take. I'll go here. He goes there. Very fair. Okay, very smart. Hmm. I'm getting myself into a tricky position now. Um. Let's try here. It's not as good anymore now that my <laughs> my queen's here, but I'll go ahead and recapture. Go ahead and recapture. And I still have this. It's not really as much of a trap anymore. Okay, it goes here. I might go here. Or I could move the rook. Or the bishop. Gonna go here, here. Mm. I think I'll move the rook. Okay. Good move. Mm. I'll move my bishop as well. Yeah, I'm not doing so hot this game. <laughs> I shouldn't have played for that trap. It worked well whenever I was in the 800s or anything below a thousand worked very well, but the higher I've gotten, <laughs> it doesn't work too well, especially in rapid. Still works well in blitz, blitz and bullet. But if they have a lot of time to think about it, now nah, it doesn't really work. Okay. Creating battery, some pressure on my king. Have not castled yet, so I won't do that. This is still defended. Could take here. Um, any cool tactic here? Check. Ah, uh, no, he has this. No. Hmm. I guess the most simple answer would be this. Now I actually have some threats. Okay. Hmm. Trying to find a mate. I don't know. I don't see. Um. Okay. So he did leave this hanging. But he could capture here. But that would allow me to go here. Which would be... Very close to mate. <laughs> uh, let's see. This is just a very delayed fishing pole trap. <laughs> okay, so I can take here. Alright. Check. Here. Mate. Right? Oh my gosh, I can't believe that just worked out. <laughs> Only one mistake? Oh, I felt like that was a terrible game. 
83 accuracy. So is this an option as well? Inaccuracy? Okay. So, see, if they are to take here, then it's really bad for them. Then if they go there, then it's even worse. <laughs> but. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that was just a very uh, delayed fishing pole trap. Okay. Let's do another. Three trappy games in a row. Man. Okay, let's try... Let's try the Vienna again. See what we get. See if we get another Gambit. Or... Or... Traditional. Well, Okay. I'll go ahead and go bishop out. Well, this is interesting. <laughs> Everything in me is wanting to go queen f3 and hope that he takes and then just mate him. Looks like a good move, right? You're, you're threatening my my queen. I've had three trappy games in a row. <laughs> um, oh my goodness. Do I really want to try that? You know what? Let's do it. Should I just pre-move it just in case? <laughs> oh, what if this works? I actually hope this does not work. <laughs> okay, it did work good. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, jeez. <laughs> hmm. So now we're in a weird position, though. So what do I do? Do I attempt to do it again? <laughs> okay, I'm attempting it again. He wants to do it. You know he does. He's hovering over this pun right now. One click away from greatness. I believe in you. Who cares? Nobody cares. I believe in you. You can do it. No. Oh. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. I'll take. Hmm. He did that with the quickness. Uh, let's go here. Here or here. Either way. Then I might kick this and threaten this as well. If he develops. If he goes here, I'll go knight to e2. Hmm. I could still. Yeah, I guess I will. D4 is also an option. D4 actually probably would have been better because I'm gaining control of the center and I would also be threatening this pawn this pawn <laughs> all right I guess I'll go ahead and d4 now since he added an attack there he might go here or there yes uh, I'll go ahead and double up here hmm okay could go here. Would it be worth it to sack 
here, then check, and gain it back. That's an option, right? I don't know which one I would want to sack, though. Mm. I'll sack the knight. And then I can check. Would queen... Queen f7 be mate? It seems like it. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I can still do it though, right? So take, take. Check. Move here, and then that's mate, right? Here, here, here. Is that right? Okay. I guess I could go here. Ah, I don't know if I should take any more. Let's see. I can castle. I'll castle. I'll castle, and if he takes, then it's still the same threat. Just in case. <laughs> we'll do that. I've tried trapping this guy so many times this game, and he will not have any of them. <laughs> I'm disrespecting him. This is an option. It defends this, attacks the queen, and also threatens c7. That's a good move. Here, here, and here. Okay, now what do I do? Do I pull the bishop back now, finally? Over with the shenanigans? <laughs> you know what? I'll give him one last chance. One last chance to fall for the trap. <laughs> He's too good. Um, guess I'll take... I can go here, and then here, no, this, he can't take here, he can take here though, this doesn't work anymore because of this, check here, Check. Then he goes here. I guess here, then here. This doesn't work. We moved here, which does allow for this. Okay. This might be a move. This is not mate. I guess I can go here. I 
We could check. Or go here. I don't know if I should check. Well, I do have a pawn on h6. You know what? <laughs> Wait, is... If he goes here... Check, check. Here. Take, take. I can't go here anymore, can I? But I can just take. Instead. Yeah, if he goes here, I'll just take. Okay. That makes sense. My brain went dumb for a second. Yeah, I totally forgot about my pawn all the way on h6. <laughs> yeah, because if before if I went check here, and then he defended, take, take, and then I pushed the pawn, then he would have this, and I would have no way of actually promoting my pawn on h8. So I believe I had to push there. Maybe. Whoa. Okay. Wasn't expecting that move. I guess I'll go ahead and promote to another queen. I don't know if there's an easier way to do this. Let's see. I can... If I check here, defend check does that work here blocks if he does go here oh okay he goes there interesting could go here check If he goes at a6, I take the knight. Could go here. Sometimes I'm not very good at finding the mate, but we're trying. Um, let's see here. Maybe here? We're here. Wait, is that mate? No, it's not mate because he has this. After there, I could trade. Or. Oh no, I almost went here. I would have blundered that. I'll take like this first, and then threaten a discovered. It might have been better for me to take here. But if I do get d6, then I think it's checkmate. Okay, he does that very well.
We're very close now. Okay, we did it. <laughs> that was a long one. Good game. How many moves was that? 39? Had a 90 accuracy. My middle game had a brilliant. I had two brilliants. Was it the bishop sack? Oh. So it was the knight. Because if takes, then this. Same here. The same mate. And same after this, if takes. <laughs> um, did I have a mate later on? Should have sacked it. My take, take. Oh, that's my mate. I see. Finally got my mate in one in there. Well, good game. Uh, we're twelve nineteen. Let's try one last one. This is going to be a little bit of a longer video, or maybe not, because the first couple games were very. This. I'll still go C6. First couple of games were very short. I'm assuming D3 was uh, a mouse slip and he meant D4. We'll go with that. I guess I could treat this like the Rizzo Gambit. Push this, then here, take it back. Okay, he doesn't take. Develop my knight. If he takes, I'll go e3 or e6. Okay, still doesn't take. But pushing here does allow me to go here, because it's no longer defended. I'm going to go ahead and develop my queen so that I can castle. Possibly castle. We'll develop. Mm, long castling seems kind of, <laughs> kind of weird here. Yeah, let's open it up a little. Get some breathing room. Okay. <clears throat> Since this bishop is not going to be developed anytime soon, I think I'll bring my queen back and target this undefended pawn. Take. If he takes back with the horse, then I get the pawn. Okay, he does not. Defend this pawn. Double. So he castles, but this is pretty weak. Um, could go here. Threatening this. No, no, that would just hang the knight. So I could go here and double up on it. Let's try that. I'm pretty happy that he castled into this. The dark squares are very weak around him. We'll go ahead and create a create an attack on this side. Let's 
So he has three defenders on F4. He's attacking H5. Have we defended three times? Interesting move. I guess it's the uh, triple up <laughs> here. Um, okay. H4 might be an option. Just, let's try that. This is a confusing position for me. <laughs> Good castle. Uh, I don't know what to do here. Maybe we can start trading off a little bit? If he takes, I'll probably take with the G-Pawn to open this up. I'll go ahead and castle. What should I do here? Mm. Oh. I'll go here, threatening this pawn. Might start doubling up here. trapped am I? No I'm not. I think I can take here. I'm not trapped after, th after this. I can go here. Or here. Still might possibly go here. Ninety four. I'm running pretty low on time though. Okay, he's offering a trade. You know what? We'll go ahead and trade. If he takes this way, I'll go here. I guess I still could. But there's also a free pawn here. He can't move this, or I take care. Could recapture. This is also a threat. Take. Go here. Possibly. <laughs> This is an option. May not be a great one, but it is one. Hmm. Oh, let's see here. What should I do? Can line the rook up with the king? Never really a bad idea. Threatening here. I guess I could just push the spawn to e6. And I don't really see a threat. Okay. Push 
push my pawn. Oh no, I had this. I completely missed it. <laughs> oh no, I didn't. He could have just taken with that rick. <laughs> I'm dumb. Maybe I'll push this again. And if it takes, I'll have some discoveries. I don't know if they're very strong discoveries, but it's a discovery nonetheless. Um, no. Maybe it wasn't a good move. <laughs> uh, we'll go here. I also have this idea. Okay. Guess I can still play this. Check. Mm, what now? Why did he resign? Oh, because I had this. Check. Here. Yeah. There we go. Wow. Okay. That's why he resigned. Good game. Oh, well, that was fun. 89 and 83. Well, that was a fun game as well. Good game. Alright, so we end today, episode 2, at 1226. <laughs> Pretty sure that's where we ended uh, last episode, too. Or give or take a couple of points. But thank you so much for watching this episode, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Goodbye.